Hello guys, so I am back with the wonderful opportunity from the ISRO. Very famous ISRO is hiring again for a scientist post. There is no requirement of gate and um, this time they are doing the you know selection process and everything uh, in a different way. Uh, there is some difference in the process. So I am going to tell you what is the difference and also I will be explaining all the important informations in this video. Uh, so you don't have to probably uh, you know read the notification one more time but anyway go through the notification just to confirm the things before applying okay so this is the scientist recruitment from the branch of isro that is icrb that is isro centralized recruitment board they are recruiting for scientists no requirement of gate here and uh, there is also another important things which we'll be discussing in this video so let us see what are the streams that are calling scientists civil electrical uh, air conditioning and uh, refrigeration architecture scientist sc civil autonomous body the requirement is you should be having b b tech equivalent uh, in the specific uh, stream of engineering and also the requirement of cgpa is 6.84 that is 65 percentage mark so if you don't have this qualities or not qualities eligibility criteria you can leave the video here itself because these are for the recruitment is for those category of people now let's talk about the graduation year all the graduates can apply and also the final years can apply provided that your degree is available on 31st of august and also you should be having uh, 65 percentage of mark okay so that is the criteria now let us talk about the age limit 28 is years is the age limit and also there is age relaxation for all the reserved categories as per government of india rules let us talk about the application process you can apply from 24th of june which is already started to uh, 14th of july and also one more thing they have given here is application fees is there there is only 250 rupees fees generally all the government of uh, india organization they ask for 1000 rupees and plus but here it is only 250 but the difference is that here this time what you have to do is uh, all the candidates uh, like um, women SST candidates persons with disabilities or and ex serviceman everybody have to pay initially 750 rupees okay now this uh, women SST candidates persons with disabilities and ex serviceman these people are exempted from fees that is you don't have any fees so your 750 rupees will be refunded once you are applying once you are attempting uh, for the written test that is once you are appearing for the written test and for uh, the other people like underserved categories and also women sorry not women men you guys will be refunded only 500 rupees i hope it is clear that is everybody has to initially pay 750 for the women sst person with disabilities and ex service you guys will be refunded whole amount that is 750 rupees itself and for our other candidates 500 rupees will be refunded so the fees they are taking is 250 rupees okay so that is very important to note so this is a very great or big change this time they are doing in the uh, you know fee collection so please be aware of that okay selection process consists of test and interview just like all the isro uh, selection process these are the test centers ahmedabad bengaluru tiruvannapuram hyderabad kolkata all the main cities have test centers so you don't have to worry talking about the selection process of written test part a consists of your discipline based questions 80 questions is there and also there is um, negative marking okay so please be aware of that part b is aptitude test and uh, part b doesn't have any negative marking yes okay so that is the case now talking about the interview again they have given the dividend or division technical knowledge 40 marks general awareness 20 mark communication skill 20 comprehension 10 and academic achievements also 10 mark cutoff mark total 60 percentage for underserved category 50 percentage only for the reserved category that is a cutoff mark payment is 56,100 is the monthly payment for the scientist post so it is a wonderful opportunity to apply if you are interested because the payment is really really good and it's going to be a full-time full-term job okay okay so that is an important thing now let's see the last stage which we have already seen so you have to apply through the online portal that is only way of applying uh, and the last date is 14th of july i'll be putting the link in the description so you can go to the link and read the notification and then you can apply okay so that's all for this video 
thanks for watching please keep on watching the channel for job opportunities especially from the code domain thank you